If you find one of these for sale, or better yet for free, you might want to reconsider getting it. Most often when a chainsaw won't start, it'll either be a problem with the carb or maybe the fuel lines. But when you realize that you need to take the chainsaw almost completely apart to do that, you might want to change your mind. Now, I don't normally push for the use of battery electric chainsaws, but in this case, I think they're a much better option when it comes to sporadic use by a homeowner. Otherwise, you're going to realize just how much fun it can be to fix or enjoy how much lighter your wallet's going to be when you pay someone else to do it. Mm-hmm.